Hi you guys, <laughs> episode 13 of the Boys Heart. Okay, so they finally got together, y'all. Oh, and once again, I'm sorry for, you know, the person calling me during the last video. But I just, sometimes when people, well, all the time when people call me, I just, you know, um, start recording this, the game all over. But it takes too long, and then y'all just be rushing me to put it out. So y'all just have to see that. All right, this is a recap, recap, recap. Okay. Finally, they're bonking. Okay, I felt like a piece of shit. I was literally going to leave uh, Xavier for his brother. How awful can that be? We all really t we all together. I owe him an, a, a, a gigantic <laughs> apology at school today. This is gonna be hard to say, Xavier. What that you're dating Alex now? How did you know that? You don't get to do it. Yo, you don't get it, do you? Get what? This was my plan, Carter. I pretended to be sick so Alex can take take the part mm -hmm. I see the way you both look at each other I'm not stupid if you both are happy then I'm happy are you upset with me it'll take some it'll take me some time to get over things but I promise you that I'll be okay just do your thing Carter and I'm sure Alex will love you even more for it <sighs> I'm just really sorry I never wanted to do this to you don't apologize for your happiness, Carter. Just hold on to that shit. To, to that shithead. Hell no. Y'all calling each other shitheads and dickheads and all type of motherfucking heads around this bitch. Thank you, Xavier. You're a good person. I know. I'll see you around. Okay. Three weeks later. Okay. Fuck. Okay. How did things go again? He was actually really mature about it. Okay, okay, let's not talk about it any anymore. <laughs> We're dating now. You don't have to get jealous anymore. Carter, I'll get jealous if I want to. <laughs> we already going to start off with a fight. Oh, wait, are we, are we already going to start off with a fight? I don't know. You started it. You know that you're an ass, right? Don't you want your surprise? Surprise, what did you do? I got us tickets to see the new horror movie in the movie theater downtown. I don't think I can do that, Alex. It'll be fine. I'll be there sitting next to you. No, not that. It's that their popcorn is stale as shit. <laughs> All right. It doesn't matter. It's the date that counts, right? Where did this Alex come from? You're ruining the moment again. The moment again. Let's just meet up after school. I heard, uh, I heard you both finally started dating. What are you? What? what bitch, y'all teachers be too involved in the life, girl. I've been waiting for this day. I shipped you both. Oh, well, I shipped you both since day one. What the hell does that mean? I don't know what the hell y'all mean when y'all say shipped. Like, what is? What the fuck is shipped? It gets, oh, shit. Why didn't you let, let me drive her to her house back when we were on the trip then? I still need to do my job as a teacher. Your driving is horrible more than Emma's. Hey. I I even made a ship name. Okay. Um, Calix. How does that sound? That's uh, good, I guess. No, girl. No, girl. Dial. I spent three days on that <laughs> show some appreciation. <laughs> Slow your roll, man. Slow your roll, but you lose your soul, honey. I got my eye on you, Parker. Why do everybody moonwalk away from <laughs> What the hell is that? Up with that. After school. Why don't he still get on his fucking football uniform? Ready for that stale ass popcorn? Of course. 
Why is this whole room empty? Isn't it a new movie? I rented the whole theater. You didn't have to do that. Like I said before, it's the power of being incredibly hot and being rich. I'll be back. This being the first date, he really did go out of his way for me. So is he about to go pop some fresh popcorn? Guess what I got? What did you get? I got their nasty, shitty candy. <laughs> How much do they sell their candy for? I don't know. I stole it. Okay, girl. Alex, you can't just go around stealing things. Yes, I can. I mean, I do it every day. I actually stole cigarettes and alcohol yesterday. That's not even even possible, but I did it. Sometimes I don't understand you. I like you. You like me. I think we understand each other enough. Can't argue with you on that one. Now be quiet. The movie is starting. Alex tightly holds my hand throughout the movie. <laughs> makes faces of pain while watching the killing scenes. Of course I had to laugh but also yell out of pain. His nails literally digging inside of my hand. <laughs> After the movie... <laughs> Cause you're a girl. That movie was great. Oh, wait, oh, wait. Thanks for the movie, Alex. It was too great. I totally wasn't scared. You're a terrible liar. You made little marks in my palm from your nails. That's not true. Alexander James Parker. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, my God. Jesus fucking Christ. I don't have the time for this, bitch. Jeanette, is that her name? Jeanette, the witch is back, not the damn witch. Mom, can you stop interrupting things? Yep, Jeanette. <laughs> Jeanette's ass is irritating. I can't believe that you're disobeying me. I don't know why you're surprised. I could have been doing this since I walked. I remember that time. Well, remember you tried to teach me to say mom, but I learned how to say vodka instead. Okay, bitch. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> this is no time for jokes. Relax. We're on a date. We can talk when at home. Date? Alex, you probably shouldn't have said that. No kidding. <laughs> Come with me right now, Alexander. Take a chill pill. We can talk later. Miss Parker, we don't have to cause a scene here. Can you just please, or can you please just, don't you dare talk. Oh, bitch. I didn't put all my, I didn't put all of my work out there just for you to screw it up. You're going away out of hand. Just stay away from both of us. Get in the car, Alex. Just obey. Just please obey me for once. We're still on the uh, obeying thing. <laughs> Get in the car now. You should go. I'm so sorry, Carter. I don't like this bitch. Where do I start? Oh, yeah. Stay away from Alex. I don't need you ruining things. I worked too hard to have you mess up his future. What future? He literally screwed up all of his chances in school. No offense, Alex. I'm just saying, girl. <sighs> With all of my respect, I don't think this is any of your business. Don't you care about his happiness? If he wants to be with someone like me, then let him. I didn't ask you for words of wisdom. Now stay away. Bitch. Can we cuss her out? What the fuck? I don't give a fuck that this is his mama. She needs to be cussed the fuck out. Like how you cuss Emma's ass out. That's how you need to cuss that mama's ass out. Okay? Again that night I heard rocks sitting in my window. For her to not want her or him around her. She sure do not be keep the tabs on her fucking kid. You know I have a front door, right? And let me in. It's freezing out here. <laughs> Why are you here at 9 at night? Can we just go up to your room first? My feet are literally frozen. Then let's go. Because you ain't in a fucking shoes on. What's going on? Again, I wanted to apologize for, you know, let's just not talk about that. I'm just a little worried about what, you know, that we won't make it. Why would you even say that? 
we're going to make it even not even the not even the witch can separate us hell no nah. i'm smoking my motherfucking witch i won't let anything happen carter you don't have to worry about a thing nothing will happen to you nor me i promise you i know this will sound corny but we'll stick together like glue i don't know how but you always know what to say alex this, what? Okay. Mm-hmm. I'm Alex. I always know what to say. Right, because you always run that fucking yap of yours as well. Shit. <sighs> you know, you have my number right. You didn't have to come all the way over here. Can I not see my girlfriend? Uh, you saw me three hours ago. <laughs> I have to decline this. God damn. <sighs> Shit. Mm-hmm. Watch, he's just gonna keep fucking calling because. Okay, I saw you three hours ago. I'm sorry, (laughs) y'all. Once you have me wrapped around your finger, I won't let you go anytime soon. I do. I do don't. What? I do, don't I? Okay. Because I'm like, what? Of course you do. I'll see you tomorrow. I can hear your dad snoring up here. That is where I get it from. Go figure. Well, I got to... What do you think you're doing, you idiot? What did I do wrong now? You're not wearing any shoes. So, wear the shoes that were next to my door. Okay. Wait, I'm okay. I don't need shoes. You see, I have strong feet. No, you're putting the shoes on. I'm fine. Now I'm going. You're not getting sick on my watch, you little shit. Okay, fine. I don't want to wear these, Carter. I said, put the shoes on, you tard. (laughs) Quit yelling. You're going to wake up your dad. Then put the shoes on. But they're not even my size. Wow. And I thought that I had big feet. Uh Alex shoved his feet inside the shoes and tried to (laughs) tie the shoelaces. Hell no. Okay. They're happy. Very. I'm actually going to go now. Be careful. Yeah, yeah. <sighs> the bell rang a couple of minutes ago and Alex still wasn't here. Students, we have a new student here with us today. Her name is Alice. Oh, god damn. Not in Wonderland, baby. Hi, everyone. I'm Alice. He said... Oh, uh, he already said that. <laughs> okay, yeah. If there was some way for me to stretch my arms all the way across the face to slap her, I would. <laughs> You can sit with Carter for now until Alex gets here, which won't be until another 30 minutes. Where the hell is Alex at? Hi, I'm Carter. Well, you already know that. So who's this Alex guy? He's my boyfriend. That's cool that you both can sit next to each other. Yeah, it is. Well, I know it's going to come off a little straightforward, but can we be friends or something? Unless you don't want to, which is completely fine. Yes, we can be friends. Thank goodness. I thought I was going to have to be a loner. Carter, we need to talk for a second. I'll be right back. Yes, sir. Sounds like Alex was injured. What? What do you mean? (sighs) You should go see him. Uh, Carter, you're excused. Where the fuck is he at? Wait, wait. What? Everyone pray for the team Calyx. Okay, well, ew, I'm not going to. I don't give a flying poop, Emma. Damn it, where the where is the freaking hospital? Ugh, where is it? Calm down, Carter. Who the hell is this? Come with me. Sorry, I have to. Bitch. Oh. Okay, what the fuck? All right, y'all, let's let's see what's popping on this next episode. 
Catch me on the next one, y'all. Catch me on the next one.